You can get a bigger Chanel back in the store if you want it. I gave them the drill, they set it up, I got them on it. I bought a new bag, I had to wait so watch the tone. Taking these drills, I'm gonna be up until the morning. It ain't your car, you just a listen. What's up, y'all? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, hey girl, hey, make sure you hit the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so you'll be notified when I upload a new video. And if you are not already, follow me on Instagram at the Hair Life and the Hair Life Official. So, you guys, um, today's video is sponsored by Eunice. Thank you guys for sponsoring this video. They sent us over a V part wig and some other goodies in the box that I showed you guys. So, I'm showing you the inside construction of this unit. This unit can be installed without leave out, but I wanted to try it with leave out. Um, I had just washed my hair and trimmed my ends and everything. So I wanted to just go ahead and try with the leave out because I don't have my hair often and you don't need braids to do this install. So I'm showing you guys right here. Um, it has some wig combs and clips, also an adjustable strap. So I pinned this to my mannequin head so I could curl it, just threw some body curls in it. And I'm gonna be using Work Prey Slay's curling iron, you guys. This is great for anybody who doesn't know how to really curl with this type of curling iron. It twists on its own for you, so you don't have to do all the wrist work. So I was just showing you guys that, but I just threw some quick body curls in it. And then I'm gonna show you guys how I installed it. Like y'all, it literally took me all of five minutes to install this super quick and easy. So you guys, this hair was very, very soft. It was so easy to curl and my hair actually blended in with it really good. You guys will see that in a little bit. But the curls, y'all see these curls? They were so pretty. And I did not even wash this uh, prior to installing. I usually do, but I just got in the mail and I wanted to get this video out to you guys. So yeah, here is my leave out area. You guys can see it's not that much at all. And I had had like my edges laid earlier. So I didn't really have to do much. So I am just finding my middle part trying to figure out how much hair needs to go on each side. And you guys, when I tell you, all you have to do is literally clip the unit around your leave out. Like it gave me natural sewing vibes. I love this. This is great for, you know, you want to look cute, but you don't really feel like laying lace. This is literally perfect for that. So I did adjust this before I put it on my head. You guys know I have a tiny little head. So I'm gonna show you guys in a little bit the sides. If I were to put it all the way down, it would be over my ears, but it was still fine. It, it fit my head pretty good. And I did just bring those combs in at the top or the clips in a little bit at the top. So it could be like flushed to my leave out. And I did um, put the combs on the side and into my hair and in the back. So I did do some light layering in the front. I just took a piece of the hair with my hair to blend it in, took my scissors, ran it down at an angle, and I did curl that afterwards. I did the same thing on both sides on the front, and then I curled it so my hair will blend in with the unit, and you guys, that was it. I didn't need to use my hot comb or anything. I had sh like straightened my hair out two days prior to this, so I don't want to use too, too much heat. And I'm going to straighten out that little, that little bump right there that y'all see. I'm going to straighten it out. So don't worry, but that's all I needed to do. These do come in different textures. The link to this exact unit will be down below. And you can check out their website for the other textures that they have as well. If you guys want to see me um, do another texture, let me know down below. And we can get something worked out for that. Because I... I didn't know how I was gonna feel about this at first, you guys, but I actually really, really like this. So I will be wearing this. I will be wearing this often. Okay, so this is what I was talking about a little bit earlier. I was saying like it could come completely down over my ears, but like I said, it still fit fine. I just took my wide tooth comb, combed out these curls, and you guys like my hair blended in so good with this. I was actually really surprised. I sprayed some Sebastian Shaper Spray. Y'all know that's my favorite. I just sprayed some of that on there. And this is the finished look, you guys. Let me know if you guys have tried one of these, if you are interested. 
let's get in the comments and chat and i was just like touching on my baby hairs but y'all that's the finished look i hope y'all enjoyed this video i will catch y'all in my next one thank y'all so much for watching bye Tattoo, you gon' fuck around the drive Off this way, doing all the shows I've been on the road,